Modern Warfare just took a massive L. It's something that many people figured would happen at one point or another, and now the day has finally become upon us. The game just seemed too good to be true. A new Modern Warfare game, in which every single party, Xbox, PlayStation, and PC can play together, no timed exclusivity with maps, it all comes out in the same day, no season pass. It just sounded like heaven. And we knew Activision at one point or another was going to find a way to shove their dicks down our throats. And today they've done it. The Spec Ops Survival Mode is exclusive to PlayStation. But it's not just for a week, like content has been for the past couple CODs. It is not a month like it was when Xbox had the exclusivity deal. No, it's a full year. If you purchase the game on PC or Xbox, you won't get the Spec Ops Survival Mode for a full year until October of 2020. So you're still paying full price for a game that you're not getting the full content for. Now I would understand a week and I would understand a month, but having a full game mode locked behind a one year exclusive deal is fucking ridiculous. It is super anti-consumer and by the time the mode comes out for PC and Xbox, nobody's going to care. It's the same thing that happened with Destiny 1. By the time that Xbox and PC got the content that PlayStation got for a full year, which was some strikes and, and some other content for Destiny 1, nobody cared when it came out because there was new and better stuff on the horizon. A new Call of Duty comes out every single year, and by the time that Xbox and PC get this survival mode, no one's gonna really care anymore. The new Call of Duty is gonna be out or coming out very soon and Modern Warfare's life cycle will pretty much be over. So when the game is finally dead pretty much, and not being supported as much, well, that's when we get this new mode. It's just ridiculous. You pay full price for a game. $60, $80, or $100. You would expect to get the full content, however you're not getting that. I understand that Sony still has this contract, and they still are legally obligated in some sense to have some content early, but having it a full year when Call of Duty is a yearly release is fucking ridiculous, and it's just something I won't stand for. I see a lot of people trying to defend it, saying, well then just don't buy the game and stuff like that, and that's true. The only way we're getting things to change is by voting with your wallet. We need to have this kind of outlash to say, hey Activision, no. This is ridiculous. The fact that we're gonna have to wait one full year for content in a game that comes out every single year is ridiculous. If you want to have this mode exclusive to one console for a year, then give me a slight discount on the game. I'm not getting all of the content, so why should I pay full price for it? I get it that the survival mode is not a huge, gigantic part of the game, but it's still a super anti-consumer practice. And the only way we're going to get Activision to even hear us is to cause a loud uproar and even cancel pre-orders. They're only going to care once it affects their dollars. That's all I really have to say about this situation. We knew Activision was going to do something anti-consumer, and here it is. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comments down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheerio, mates!